Hey guys, this is Eshma Lamte. In today's video, I want to share with you how I finance most of the gear I own or use whenever I am purchasing them. So, um, it is actually good to know that most of these gear or devices that I currently have or own, I don't pay cash for them whenever I'm purchasing them. That's majority of them actually. And this is possible by the financing options which are available for some of these sites. So sites like um, Dell, I'm sure HP should also have something like that. Sites like BJ also have uh, options to use Affirm to be able to finance your purchase. And then you pay later. So for Dell, if you've noticed, I've actually been a very big fan of Dell for like for some years now. My past two laptops were Dell for all from Dell and even my current laptop is actually from Dell. So what I do is, I go ahead to place an order for the desired laptop that I want, that is if I'm purchasing a laptop. And then once I you know, have it purchased and get it shipped to me, I go ahead to move my existing files from the old laptop to it. I go ahead to sell off the old laptop and then use the money to finance the, um, the new laptop. Sometimes it's not able to get up for the entire cost. So uh, at least it does like about 80 or 90 percent and then I later pay um, the rest. So for sites like Dell, um, depending on what you're buying and how much it's involved, I sometimes personally get like um, for about an entire year with no interest on the amount. And then after a year, if you're able to pay off the amount, you you know, there's some sort of interest generated on the amount. But a year is a year, good you know, duration to be able to pay off amounts like $1,000, 1002 and um, so on. So that is what I mostly use to be able to finance, especially my laptop. And then recently, I even got a couple of stuff from DJI and I use the Affirm option to be able to finance that. Now with Affirm, you also have, I think, um, interest fee for some period. But if it's a longer duration, then it's going to generate some, you know, um, little amount of interest on the amount. And this makes it, you know, a bit um, easier to own devices now and then pay for them later. Now, in my case, whatever device I buy, I try as much as possible to have sort of a plan for it to be able to um, generate sort of um, um, income or money to be able to help pay for, you know, the cost that is there as well as, you know, be able to get something out of it. So that's what I mostly go, you know, do to go about, you know, financing most of the gear that I currently own or use. And it's actually good to know that most of these options are available in countries like US, uh, sometimes even in Europe, um, European countries and so on. Now, how is it possible for me not in the US to be able to have, you know, be able to benefit from this option? So that's where my top secret, top secret comes in. So um, good for me. I've had a friend who has been in the US for long. Um, he's actually a citizen in the um, US. And um, he mostly makes it possible for me. So for um, like whenever I want to make a purchase, I am able to use his credit um, facility to be able to make my purchase. And I try as much as possible to pay on time. Like about five years now, I've been doing this and I, there hasn't been a single time where I have defaulted in paying for my, you know, uh, my, should I say, credits and, and, and so on. So he makes it possible for me to do that. Uh, all I need is his credit um, account, I think. Yeah. And most of the time it's tied to, you know, your phone number. So I just use his um, phone number, especially for a firm. I use his phone number and then um, I was given an amount that I can spend. And that was like about 5000 or $4,000 or so. Yeah. That I'll have like an entire year to be able to pay for. That amount and of course the higher you spend um if there's interest the higher the interest is going to be depending on how long you're looking at paying for that particular amount so that's how i go about getting the financing option especially when i'm purchasing from sites in the u.s so this my friend has been super helpful um over the years and yeah now a good thing also with some of these credits is the more you purchase and then you pay on time it increases your credit score and you're even able to get you know advanced um, or much money depending on what you are looking at. So just take it like um, this MTN Momo um, as a loan. Yeah, so once you get a loan, less about 20 cities and you pay on time, the next time you get 50 cities and so on and so forth. So that's the same way with um, some of these um, options, um, especially when you are using the credit facility to be able to finance for them. So yeah, I mostly get to purchase my devices a year without paying cash. For them as of when i'm purchasing them and then have like about an entire year to be able to spread the cost across and then pay off um 
and money, which I feel is actually cool and has actually helped me a lot because um, a lot of these gear that I use, I didn't have to pay cash for them because not always I will have cash to be able to pay for them and then get them. But um, because of this option, which I'm super thankful to my friend for making it possible for me, I'm able to enjoy some of these benefits. And then also purchasing is one point. Um, the second aspect is how you're actually going to get it shipped to you once you purchase it. Now, considering high cost of, you know, um, shipping um, as well as your know, customs fee over here, it's uh, it's crazy. So what I also do when it comes to shipping is I am actually, you know, um, privileged to have um, or know a couple of people who uh, mostly travel to US and back. So then I try to find out from, you know, them. Um, who is you know coming to Ghana somewhere and then once I get to know I you know make arrangement for whatever I want to purchase get it purchased on time and then deliver it to the address and then once they're coming you know they bring it to me because I enjoy this privilege also I try as much as possible not to abuse it so then whenever I'm buying something or purchasing something I am mindful of the size the weight yeah it's very very important because you can't, yeah, the fact that you are getting things shipped to you for free doesn't mean that you should be buying anything at all. So, yes, I, I stay within my limit. I don't buy huge things. I don't buy heavy things, which is going to cost extra luggage and so on. I don't do that. So that is how I'm able to get some of these um, you know, devices or gear shipped to me. Of course, like a laptop is not so much heavy. A camera isn't so much heavy. You know, yes, yeah, so those are some of the things that I get um, once I'm, you know, get, you know, free um finance an option for them but also able to get to them shipped to me so this is like a very top secret that i'm sharing with you so if you have friends or maybe family members who are in probably in the states or maybe some of these um countries that allow um or have options for financing whatever purchase and stuff i think you have to it's about time you make good use of that and then try as much as possible to um, be business minded so that whatever gear, whatever device they are purchasing, you are going to be able to reap something out of it. So you can pay even more um, on uh, on time and even get other um, devices and ambition. So basically that is the end of this video. I hope it's super helpful to you and you start probably looking at thinking out of the box and see some of um, the options available in terms of getting the necessary gear you need to be able to work. So. Thank you very much for watching. In case you haven't subscribed to my channel, kindly go ahead to hit on the subscribe button and then don't forget to hit on the bell so that anytime I have a new video, you'll be the first to see it. My name is Ishmael Lamte and I'll see you in the next one.